No. This, you guys ready? Got a little brush, but I think I can clear that brush. He's down, he's down. He's down right there. Thanks, Dean. <laughs> Yeah, there's a little piece of brush right in front of them, but I could clear it. Yeah. It's like a lower part of them. This wind had them so spooky. They were yeah. Yeah. Nine inches. His Nine beams inches. are huge, too. Wide spread. Nice deer. That's, you know, I'm not like I, I, mean, I can't say enough about hunting in an area like this. You get to look at the deer so long. That leg was so messed up. Beautiful butt, dude. Thing. These blinds are incredible, I'll tell you. They're comfortable, they're safe, they're good to shoot out of. He's an old buck. Yep, perfect. Nice. They rut wind usually. This is the second run. Even through the even through the end of the season, deer still come to orange good. You know, you still see deer chasing those. Right, right. It's a nice eight point boy. Probably four or five. But Got her. It was right in the shoulder. Yes. I got her somewhere right here in the front of the shoulder. It looked like it. It's hard to tell with these small power scopes. Everything worked perfect. We got the wind in our face. Didn't get a bunch of does out, but one's enough. Hey, took one male out, one female out. Keep the balance. This is a really neat gun. It's a, it's a Python Hunter. Colt made it a while back. You know, you could put the your scope, and you can carry it around in your pocket, and then you just put it right back on, and it's always on sight. Pretty neat. And I just carried it around. This is a, of course, one of the holsters that a, our sponsors, Kirkpatrick Leather, makes. It's a heck of a holster. It's a really neat hunting holster. I like it. And I can go out there in the brush with that deer. And all I can do, all I need is my open sight in case it gets up for some reason. You know, fit sideways back like that, pull it out real quick. You know, Kirkpatrick makes some really super holsters. 
this scope goes right in my pocket. That's how I carry it, because if you're walking to the blind like we do, you want to be in the brush, you're going to be in the brush, walking through the brush. You don't want to have that scope on because they're so small and they have maybe a 20 mm. And hard, hard to see. But that dough ain't going to go very far. You know, there's 220 grains of 